This week is Children's Mental Health Awareness Week. Reporter Jacqueline Coleman spoke to a mental health expert about the resources available at this time to help our youth. For months now, Mississippi students have been out of school learning from home in many cases, putting their creativity to the test. But for some children, this change in routine has become a hard pill to swallow. Right now, during what we're going through with the pandemic, it's like kids don't have their usual social supports available. Um, they have limited access to family supports that they might would usually rely on. They don't have the ability to go out and play on the playground at recess with their friends. And really, children need those things to help them cope. Help is out there. In fact, Director of Child and Adolescent Services Jean Robertson at Pine Belt Mental Health says they are able to offer a variety of resources to children through telehealth services. It might be through a phone call, you know, traditional call. It might be through teleconferencing or webinar platforms. Um, we really are able to meet families and youth with what accesses they have to provide those services. Robertson says at home, parents should create a familiar routine to give their kids a sense of normalcy in these uncertain times. To provide structured environments or, you know, as far as um, structured bedtimes, structured um, or scheduled times throughout the days to eat, to play, for schoolwork. Kids being able to predict things is going to help them cope better. The agency has seen an increase of children dealing with anxiety during this pandemic, but Robertson says the storm will pass. It's really important for parents to hear that most children are going to come through this with coping skills through this. They're going to, they're resilient. They're going to bounce back. For children's services, you can call Pine Belt at 601-582-1111. In Hattiesburg, I'm Jacqueline Coleman reporting.